Some of the functions of the S3 Scanner app require you to configure the settings on your iPad Mini. This video will show you how to set up your iPad so that it works smoothly with the scanner. In the settings, tap on the general icon on the left. On the right side of the screen, tap the software update field. Tapping on the software update will check to make sure your iPad Mini has the most current operating system installed. If your iPad's operating system is not up to date, follow the prompts on your screen and update the device. This may take several minutes. After you've updated your iPad Mini, scroll down in the General section until you see the Device Management option. Tap on Device Management. In the Device Management window, there should be a field that reads New Skin Enterprises. Tap on this field. The S3 Scanner app should be listed among the apps that have New Skin Enterprises as a developer. Confirm the S3 Scanner app as a verified application. Return to the General menu by tapping on the General icon on the left again. Scroll down on the left until you find a list of apps that are installed on the iPad Mini. Find the S3 Scanner app icon in the list of apps and tap on it. This will open a menu on the right listing various features on the iPad Mini that you wish to allow the S3 Scanner app to access. Find the camera option and slide the button to the right in order to allow the S3 Scanner app to access the iPad's camera. Your iPad Mini has now been configured to work fully with the S3 Scanner app if you do not follow these steps, then you may encounter situations where the app has limited functionality.